Hey guys, sorry for the super crazy hair. And I'm going to show you guys this look that, okay, I've seen a couple people do it, but most recently I see her name is Wendy. I don't know if you guys are following her channel, but I'll put her link below. And she does a bunch of fashion videos and she teaches you how to wear scarves, how to wear a blazer, how to do everyday outfits and stuff like that. She has a wonderful blog page. Uh, we recently started talking on Twitter and she's extremely nice. So anyway... This look is inspired by her. She'll probably be surprised when she sees this, but I always see her wearing this super cute, chic look with um, a bun in the back, a hairband, and a little bit of volume at the top. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that today, so stay tuned and keep on watching. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is brush my hair and not my earring. <laughs> you really want to brush everything out because you don't want it to be naughty and you can do this with curly hair or straight hair. I'm doing it with curly hair today because that's just what I happen to have. And because you're putting your hair all the way back in a bun, um, it's totally fine. It doesn't matter what hair type you have at all. The reason I'm having a bad hair day, let me tell you guys what, what I did. It was so silly. So I was recently sent a couple products and I was trying them out. And one of them was like a um, moisture cream for your hair after you've taken a shower. I put way too much in my hair. I don't know why I did that. So now my hair is like a big fat grease ball. We're going to start teasing it. Now if you are having problems with teasing, it's probably, like if you can't get enough lift or volume, it's probably most likely because you're not teasing it correctly. You're, and if you pick up just random sections and you start teasing it, you're not going to get a good tease. What you need to do to get the perfect big volumized tease is to use a dry shampoo or hairspray. Um, I like using a dry shampoo because I feel like it holds the um, tease a little bit better and it makes it more volumized. And you need to properly section out the hair so that each section you're taking is equal to the next and that will really create a big lift. So what I'm going to do is brush all my hair back like this. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take sections like straight across. See this section right here, if you were to take that, it'd be way too big. So you need to split it in half. And even that is a little big, but it's okay because my bangs are going to be going back. So I'm going to take my dry shampoo. This is Salon Graphics Invisible Dry Spray Shampoo that I got at Target. It's pretty cheap. Spray it right at the root. Massage it in. And then what you want to do is take your brush and just lightly start teasing in a downwards motion, concentrating mostly at the roots. I'm going to start smoothing this big faux hawk out. And I'm actually going to tease the sides a little bit. I forgot about those. So for that, you can probably pick up just random sections and just start teasing backwards or towards the back. <laughs> now that we've got it all smoothed out, I'm going to start putting it into a bun. So I'm just twisting the bun here. So coming back, what you want to do with this remaining hair is give it a good spray so that it stays down. Okay, so I'm gonna take my hairband. This one is from J. Crew. it's only like $6.99 I think. I'm gonna put it to where my ears are and what I'm gonna do is I'm really going to flatten out this front part. Just like that. You want it to be really flat. Now with this hair up here, what you're gonna do is just randomly take sections and pull them 
up. And that is the finished look. So here's the sides. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this simple tutorial for any hair type really and especially if you're having a bad day, this is like perfect. So anyways, thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys in my next tutorial. Please make sure to visit my blog because I'm updating it more frequently now with um, fashion, outfit of the days, more information about my videos, um, announcements, stuff like that. So please follow me on my blog, foreveryoursbeauty.com. And also let me know how you guys like the new layout on my YouTube page because I, I worked with a subscriber of mine to um, create it and we both worked really hard and we combined our ideas together. And also I want to say thank you Janine for helping me and putting up with me because I, I like everything to be perfect. So thank you so much. I'm so happy about my YouTube layout. You are so awesome. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!